like you deserve something, like at least justice for what happened. Law enforcement in Western North Carolina say a lack of trust is leading to fear within the immigrant community. And that's why the Henderson County Sheriff's Office is trying to improve relationships through outreach. They're doing that with a new position in the department. 7 News' Nikkel Smith sat down with the new community liaison about how she hopes to put people at ease. Nikkel. Yeah, Tom, the Henderson County Sheriff says fears about deportation are leading to people not reporting crimes in the area. So the hope is that this new community liaison will help to open those lines of communication. My parents brought me over when I was a little over a year old. After working with the district attorney's office, did victim witness coordinating. Mexican native Stephanie Barbosa is working to build a bridge between the sheriff's office and immigrant community. I just want to break down the barriers that we have. The Henderson County Sheriff's Office is renewing an agreement to continue the 287G program through Immigration and Customs Enforcement, better known as ICE. I am not undocumented. But I'm afraid for people that I know. I'm afraid for people that come to my office. The sheriff says he wants people to know that the only time deputies will check their immigration status is when they're booked into the Henderson County Jail. I do believe the sheriff. I believe that he has his heart in the right place. But I also, I don't think he understands how just having the 287G lingering above everybody is affecting our community. Advocate Sergio Fernandez says working with ICE creates fear. So much so they're postponing an event because of President Trump announcing raids. I prefer to keep the Latin community safe. The sheriff says in order to keep that community safe. I know people are scared of reporting crimes. He hopes the liaison, who also speaks Spanish, will encourage them to report crimes. If people don't feel comfortable, like coming directly to the magistrate or coming directly to our department um, to contact me. Our job is to help people, um, protect people, and arrest the people that should be arrested. And she's been on the job now for a couple of weeks, Tom. So what kind of plans does she have? What kind of work will we see her do? Miguel? So she says right now she's just doing a lot of community outreach and talking to different groups just to get the word out that she is available for help, Tom. I'll see if this helps the situation. Thank you, Mikkel.